Hello, hi, this is Lorenzo. Um, what I have here is a table that distinguishes the features of necrosis versus apto apoptosis. And um, you see in the left hand side, I list stimuli, histology, DNA breakdown, and tissue reaction. On the top, starting in the, the superior left is necrosis, and the superior right is the apoptosis. So I'm going to differentiate the necrosis versus apoptosis. And just read down with me, I will provide um, a graph, graphs that uh, differentiate this so you can have visual support. So for necrosis, know that the stimuli for necrosis is pathologic. Primarily, it's pathologic examples, hypoxia and toxins. Um, and the consequence is, unfortunately, irreversible cell injury and cell death. So think of this as, think of necrosis as cell homicide. So the histology for necrosis is usually large amounts of cells are affected. There are usually we see cell swelling, the swelling of a cell, um, acidosis of a cell, so a cellular acidotic is observed, um, we observe organelle disruption, loss of membrane integrity, and coagulation or liquefaction of cell proteins. That's a major indication of um, necrosis is liquefaction, the liquefactive ability of the cell proteins. So for DNA breakdown, know that it's usually random in necrosis, it's diffuse, it's everywhere, there's fragmentation everywhere, there's dissolution of the nucleus, the nucleus will dissolve, okay? Um, it usually uh, dissolves, and the tissue reaction, just remember that in necrosis there is inflammation with secondary injury to the surrounding normal, normal tissues. Okay, now we did necrosis, now we can do uh, apoptosis. Apoptosis is primarily physiological, it's genetically regulated processes in response to uh, a pathogen um, that the body reacts to, so it's usually antibody related. Or um, So just think of this as a cell suicide, okay? So histologically speaking, apoptosis, we see few cells affected, unlike necrosis, which is pathologically and it involves major cells. So apoptosis is few cells, few cells affected. We see cell, cellular shrinking due to the hydrolysis observed and cross-linking of the structure proteins within the cytoplasm and the nucleus, okay? So the organelles remain normal. The cells break down into membranes, um, into, into, uh, into fragments known as the ap apoptotic bodies, which are then phagocytized by um, neighboring um, phagocytic cells. Um, the, the DNA breakdown in apoptosis is usually orderly, nuclear condensation, and eventual fragmentation. Tissue reaction, just know that there is no inflammation and no secondary tissue injury. Uh, okay, thank you very much, and I uh, hope you enjoy this review. Cheers.